Monica, thank you. WRAL's Brian Schrader is continuing our coverage now from the Live Center with Trump's rally in Virginia. Brian. You're looking live at that rally in Chesapeake, Virginia, which is just south of Norfolk. And the event is running about an hour behind schedule, at least uh, former President Trump's appearance there. He started speaking only about five minutes ago. And coming up a little later on, we're going to listen to this and give you a sample of what he is telling the crowd here. Some of the people uh, apparently waited more than 15 hours to get a spot at this rally. The temperature right now in the lower 80s there, so they're dealing with some pretty warm weather. Uh, and I think that this event also underscores the importance of North Carolina in this election. Yes, this is in Virginia in the Norfolk area, but the Norfolk TV market encompasses a lot of northeastern North Carolina. So both candidates certainly making a play for North Carolina voters. All right. Brian, thank you. Now, if you missed last night's debate, you can find a full breakdown of everything that happened right now on WRAL.com. And that includes a fact check of each of the candidates' statements from our partners at PolitiFact. And you can stay with WRAL for continued coverage from President Biden's rally here in Raleigh and the latest from former President Trump in Virginia. More in-depth coverage is ahead at 5 o'clock. Now to another big story we've been following today, a former Wake County